hi guys it's your girl tony welcome back to my channel just want to update you guys on me going to get another covid test So I need a COVID test to return to work. It, yesterday I got a quarantine. So if you didn't know, the health department calls you and tells you when you can get off quarantine. So I'm out and about today. And the first stop is I had to make an appointment. I'm at Walgreens and um, hopefully all goes well. So this Walgreens is set up different from the last one. They actually have mobile homes outside I don't know if they actually do it here or not but the other Walgreens when I initially got tested um, you swabbed and then you dropped it in a um, a lab core box lot box but this one looks like they're collecting everything here now I did drive further for this test because this one you get back within 24 hours. Nowhere, I'm in Florida right now, nowhere offers the rapid test. So I'm a little nervous because the health department themselves told me that I shouldn't get retested and they actually wanted to call my employer um, but because they don't recommend retesting because I can test positive since tested positive so I don't know what's gonna happen <laughs> if I test positive again looks like the car in front of me and there are looks like a family <laughs> probably the whole family is getting tested while I'm waiting I'll tell you guys the other thing that kind of annoyed me and I found disturbing I don't know if I said it in my last video or not but it still bothered me that um, everyone that I came in contact with and I told them nobody got tested the primary reasons was um, they can't afford to miss work two weeks is a long time without pay um, for some employers they're not covering it currently my employer I'm getting paid so um, the other excuse that people were saying is there's no cure, what are they gonna tell me anyway? You know, which is true. Nothing, you know, they didn't tell me anything to do, nothing. When the health department called, she basically just said, this is the day you need to stay in, um, and this is the day you can come off quarantine. She's like, do you have any questions? Um, and well wishes, pretty much. To be honest, my, um, I don't even work for a major, the major airline, but the major airline, I work for a regional and the major airline, <clears throat> I didn't even know there was a doctor on, there are doctors on staff and the doctor is the one that called me from the major airline. Number one for data and tracking purposes and um, to make sure, you know, I had some kind of home remedy but that's pretty much what people are telling you to do. Stay home, isolate yourself. But I'm so glad to be out today, y'all. <laughs> it's my turn. Good morning. Good morning, I'm good. Guess what, one. one inch is far. <laughs> <laughs> Still torturous. All right. We'll email you by the end of the day. I appreciate it. Thank you. Doing the whole family because that was pretty quick. And as you guys heard, she said they'll email me by the end of the day. Hey guys, so it's a little over an hour later from taking a test and. 
I test positive again. So I've been a little bummed, <laughs> but I kind of knew that was going to happen. No, because I told you guys, my sister said there's the strong possibility that I'm going to test positive and um, it can be a while before it tests negative. And the health department also told me not to get tested. The good thing is I called my employer and I just need, to, in order to be clear to go back to work, I just need to go see my primary care doctor to sign off that I no longer have any symptoms and that I've quarantined long enough. So yeah, that's where we stand. So I'm hoping that's what takes place today. Well, no, I can't get in today, but before, before I have to go back. So, cause I feel fine. I look fine, <laughs> but don't let that fool you because again, people are running around here with it. And like I said, everyone that I've come in contact with has not been tested. So guess who's gonna stay away from them? Yeah, tested positive twice. I won't take another test until it's time for me to go home to Jamaica in a couple of weeks. So. Talk to you guys soon. See you in the next video. One week later. Hey guys, it's your girl Tony back with another video. You already know what time it is. I need this negative COVID test, y'all. I just got to Walgreens. This setup is different. It's kind of like the first Walgreens I went to, but I don't even see the lab core lock box there's no setup outside so it's supposed to be a rapid rapid location so this is gonna be interesting anyway so my last test that I took was six days ago I tried to take a test I had an appointment for a test on Saturday and CVS emailed me in the morning and canceled it. So that was a bummer. So I'm fine, thank you. No, COVID testing? All right, do you have your driver's license? I do. All right, you just hold it up for me so I can see your last name and your date of birth. Your idea, so maybe it is rapid. Um, yeah, so I took one six days ago and um, the crazy thing guys is that the requirements have changed. We have to quarantine for seven to 10 days and um, some people are, are allowed right. to go back to work. <laughs> I think I'm too far. about um <laughs> even when you're in the hospital now for covid they're not testing you before you um go home so yeah so my job just sent out an email a couple of days ago about the new requirements that i was trying to tell them that you know the health, the local health department was telling me that they don't do any kind of um, proof or, you know, after seven to 10 days of quarantining that I should be allowed to go back to work. So my company just got abreast of it and sent out this long email talking about seven to 10 days, you can, um, you can come back to work and, 
feel that um, if you were exposed, you could come back after five days. So yeah, things are changing. I don't know why the requirements are getting more lenient when we have more cases. So I don't know, I really don't know. I've been out of work for 14 days and I haven't been to work before that. So actually it's more than 14 days. So technically I can go back, they can bring me back. But luckily I'm off, <laughs> I'm off. And that just happens to be my day off. So I'm off for the next three days anyway. So for myself, I wanted to take another test. So we'll see, I'll keep you guys posted. Hopefully I have the results in an hour. Hour later, I got my results and your girl is COVID free. Yes. So, so excited. It was, I don't wish this on anybody. Um, like I said, I'm just concerned that um, the regulations are so lacking right now. So I don't know. This thing's not going anywhere anytime soon. Just continue to be safe. Wash those hands. Build up your immune system. Take your vitamins. Take your CMOS. I really think all those things played a part in me just getting bouncing back so um love you guys see you in the next video about to hit these friendly skies again